Hi, today, I will discuss phosphoric acid fuel cell, let's start with an introduction. The phosphoric acid fuel cell is considered the first generation of modern fuel cells. It is one of the most mature cell types and the first to be used commercially, with over 200 units currently in use. It consists of an anode and a cathode made of a finely dispersed platinum catalyst on carbon and a silicon carbide structure that holds the phosphoric acid electrolyte. It operates at 150 to 220 degrees Celsius. In phosphoric acid fuel cells, protons move through that electrolyte to the cathode to combine with oxygen, and electrons produce water and heat. Now, the principle of the phosphoric acid fuel cell. A high stable anode at high operating temperature accelerates the hydrogen oxidation reaction rate in phosphoric acid. During operation, the catalyst, usually, platinum, particles have the tendency to migrate and agglomerate into larger particles at an electrode. The free energy of a reaction is converted to electrical energy, which is available in the form of a potential difference developed between the two electrodes. As we all know that, at the anode, there is an oxidation reaction and at the cathode, there is a reduction reaction. And, conducting ions in such cells is a hydrogen ion, simply we can say H plus ions. The advantages of phosphoric acid fuel cell are. It has better tolerance to carbon monoxide, that means tolerates similar to 1%, is the advantage of the phosphoric acid fuel cell. They are pollution free and eco friendly. These cells are not sensitive to carbon dioxide, CO2. It has the possibility of cogeneration, means electricity to heat. And they have low volatility, etc. And, uses of phosphoric acid fuel cell are. It is typically used for stationary power generation. They are used to power large vehicles such as city buses and locomotives, etc. The disadvantages of phosphoric acid fuel cell are. The electrolyte solidifies around 40 degrees Celsius, so the fuel cell must be kept at a higher temperature to avoid damaging the electrodes. They are poor ion conductors at low temperatures. The strong corrosively of the acid causes deterioration of the electrodes. The carbon monoxide tends to severely poison platinum in the catalyst. They have relatively high startup time. The catalyst used is the high cost. And, they have sulfur sensitivities, etc. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe, that motivate me to make more videos, bye bye, see you.